all right guys welcome back to another grand cross video now this video is a little strange i mean it's a little out of the ordinary but um i wanted to go over the taunt cards in grand cross now taunt is a skill that is very very useful but you can see how many units actually have taunt there might be some who have it hidden in their like you know passives and whatnot but regardless this is about taunt skills now even though there's like a few people who have this it's actually really really clutch <laughs> some of these taunt skills are uh we'll start off with uh alioni right so alioni his taunt skill is literally like literally the same as gill thunders and arthurs now here's what i don't get about the taunt skill for um gill alioni and arthur arthur's taunt skill is exactly the same 30 45 and 75 percent and then you have this last part which is just reducing the uh, ultimate move gauge of the enemy who attacks you I, I don't understand why they just didn't buff this for gill and like alioni and stuff like that they could have easily just buffed the taunts like the, the taunt card but i guess they wanted arthur to be a little bit more unique than the rest of them so i mean it, it's whatever but I, I just find it you know kind of dumb that they didn't decide to buff it for pretty much both of these units but um regardless i think the best taunt skill might actually be deanne and um chandler i, I can't choose between these two the reason why i say that is because <laughs> deanne's taunt skill <laughs> is insane like it's it's literally insane at rank three you're not like you you can't die you, you can't die <laughs> that's just there is no ands ifs or buts about it i believe she's the only one with this taunt skill right now which increases her defense related stats but th that's insane like even though her defense related stats are like pretty bad at rank one being at 80 percent, it literally puts her crit resistance over 100 so she can't be crit like her defense is going up she like it, it's insane it, it's actually crazy if they gave this to another unit now yeah, I'm, just, I'm just saying like they <laughs> they might be one of the best units in the game with that taunt, uh, that type of taunt skill simply because it's just really really like clutch and there's not a lot of people that remove debuffs like if we go to um remove buffs right look at this whole list of units and tell me which units you actually use that remove debuffs let's take off the taunt right let's take let's take off the taunt right look at this list who do you actually use that's viable in pvp that takes off buffs nobody yeah absolutely no one right um you know there's a couple who take off buffs on their ultimate like you know the hellbrums then there's a couple people who take it off at rank three like um this deanne and arthur right they take it off at rank three on one of their skills so we go to this arthur uh his first skill typhoon slash it literally removes buffs on rank three the he, he first off he can't be using pvp but this is just an example who's gonna wait to get to rank three to remove buffs nobody absolutely no one so it might be a buff taunt but it, it's still it, it's still strong like it's still a very strong um type of taunt now chandler chandler on the other hand is very powerful because he can hit back so the more damage he takes the better at rank three this is literally death like it, it's so crazy on rank three but honestly i'm leaning towards more dn because of dn's d you know her buff like her defense buff that's why i'm leaning more towards the end of course you know you have these hidden gems like derriere derriere's taunt is good like it, it is actually really really strong because it increases her defense related stats but what she's doing at rank three deanne does at rank one the only difference is she becomes immune to stun which to be fair only really goddess elizabeth has that that's really viable in pvp so it's not like the craziest thing ever right but it, it's a good counter to um elizabeth it's actually a really really good counter but again what deanne does at rank three with her taunt Deanne does at rank one so keep that in mind had they gave oh my god had they gave derriere dn's oh my god D, yo derriere would have just been so busted she would have been busted but um you know what actually she does remove buffs now i'm thinking about it she actually does remove buffs so derriere right she does actually remove buffs but how many people have her right how many people actually use her and have her 
probably not a lot probably not a lot of people but yeah so chandler dn right these two are probably i would say have the best taunt cards Arthur is weird like Arthur I would say he probably ah, man it's hard because this depleting ultimate move gauge orbs it's very powerful right it is very very strong and at rank two it lasts for two turns and at rank three it lasts for two turns as well he also is reducing damage but I feel like this damage reduction isn't going to be as you know useful as the buff on you know Derriere not Derriere but uh Deanne as um as the damage reduction on him is right if that made sense i just feel like dairy or uh, uh dn i don't know why i keep saying dairy dn's buff i feel like it's a lot more just useful in a way because of how big her defense related stats increase all right i think it's just a bigger um stat buff so in all I, I really think dn might have the best taunt card in the game but i mean obviously it's up for opinion Rimuru's isn't bad either. Rimuru's is actually not that bad. It, um, you know, get, grants him debuff immunity, heals diminished HP. I mean, it's not bad, but it's definitely not in the, like, the, uh, the top tier of taunts in the game. And there's not really much competition, let's be real. I think Blue Greymore has the same thing as Alioni and Guild Thunder. Yeah, see, that's what I'm saying. Why didn't they just buff this, like, this taunt card in general? Why didn't they just make every single bot uh every single person who has this taunt in the game get the uh ult depletion effect because if you, i'm telling you right now had they buffed that card i'm not gonna lie guild thunder might actually be pretty pretty good because he gets resistance on his passive which increases it by 100 um, percent which is actually really good and then he also will reduce damage deplete alt gauge um i don't know about maybe he's not viable but he would be better he would literally be better but i mean it, it is what it is can't really change anything right so it, it is what it is draw has a pretty good taunt i i would say it's more i, I would say this taunt has pretty much fallen because no one petrifies anymore i honestly think derrieres might be more useful than drolls like i'm not like i'm not even kidding they could have now i'm looking at it, they could have easily gave droll deanne's taunt because they both use heavy metal so i don't understand why they, i mean when he came out, I guess he was trying to be a counter towards Blue Free uh, Fairy King, right? I guess he was trying to counter Blue King, so that way he couldn't be petrified, which would make sense. Also increasing his HP-related stats, but this has fallen because nobody uses Blue King. Like, nobody uses him. So, he has fallen a little bit in terms of taunt cards, but honestly, it's still not that bad. Esterosa is pretty good as well. Graymore, <sighs> Graymore, <laughs> Graymore isn't even really a taunt, though. This is a stance. His taunt comes from the now. I'm not. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. This right here, even it's a it's an ultimate, so it's not really fair, I guess. But this is the best. No matter what, this is literally the best taunt in the game. No matter what anyone says, cause it's an ultimate taunt. This is the best ultimate. There is no there is no discussion. I don't care. I don't care what you guys say. That, that like this skill right here. It literally is the best taunt in the game. Nothing can literally break through your defense. Um, you know, it's, it's just, it's insane because when you link him up with Dreyfus, he gets a 480% buff to his defense related stats. Yeah, his crit resistance sucks, but when you're doing, you know, adding 480% to your crit resistance, you're over 500% crit resistance. You're over, uh, yeah, 500% crit defense. Your defense itself is going to be high. It's, an, it's just, it's it's broken. It literally is broken. Um, but, you know, no one uses him, so I guess it really doesn't matter. But that is the best taunt skill in the game. Regardless of anything, Graymore's ult is the best taunt, no matter what, right? No matter what, it is the best taunt. Um, I got, you know, Blue Fardens isn't that bad. It's, it's pretty, like... It, it's, it's meh right because reflection isn't that good like it's just it's not that good unless you disable their recoveries like you know disable their recovery with uh, green merlin or something like that this reflect is actually really like pitiful <laughs> like it, it doesn't matter because they'll just heal whatever they um wh whatever they take in damage right so it, it's it's meh but yeah i would say 
at the end of the day, I do think for skills, skill wise, Deanne might take it. Deanne might actually take it, but um, you know, Graymor has the best ultimate in the game. Like, not even not, not the best ultimate in the game, but the best taunt ultimate in the game, right? He does have that. So the number one taunt goes to him for his ultimate, but for skills. D Deanne definitely got it. Deanne, I think she actually does have it because she just, I, I don't know, she she just, <laughs> the, that defense related stats buff is insane. Like it actually is pretty big. You could make the argument for Chandler. I can even see an argument for Arthur. It could go like, these three right here are very interchangeable in my opinion. Like they're very interchangeable. So let me know what you guys think down below in the comments. Do you think Deanne has the best? Do you think Chandler or Arthur has the best taunt skill? in the game or do you think um you think someone else has it but just let me know down in the comments below if you did enjoy go ahead and leave a like for the algorithm you guys already know as always i will see you all next time